Welcome back to another NBA video and in this video with preseason and training camp getting underway we have a couple trade rumors to talk about or one trade rumor but this is where it starts getting interesting. Things for the season start getting ramped up. Teams pretty much have their finalized roster but there's always a couple of late moves. In this video I'm going to be talking about the LA Lakers who traded for Patrick Beverly not too long ago. That was one of the kind of later moves because free agency had passed. The trade market was kind of dead and they made that move but I'm going to be talking about how they could get a couple more guys those guys being Buddy Heald and Miles Turner from the Indiana Pacers obviously the Pacers they're in the rebuild now they're trying to build with some new guys they got Ben Matherin in the draft they have Tyrese Halliburton in that DeMontis Sabonis blockbuster from last year so guys like Buddy Heald and Miles Turner are good trade candidates they're guys that could help a team win right now Buddy Heald phenomenal shooter Miles Turner great interior shot block and could be a very solid starting center, especially for a team like the Lakers, which I'll talk about in a second. But then they could also capitalize and get some draft picks to build around some of the guys they have and kind of just take their franchise back into winning ways because it's clear that the Pacers are in a rebuild right now. But as far as the Lakers, reports are saying that if the Lakers wanted to get a package of Buddy Heald and Miles Turner, the Pacers would be very interested if the Lakers are willing to offer two unprotected first. And for the Lakers, that's 2027 and 2029 where they have those unprotected first after they've given up some in trades past including that Anthony Davis blockbuster they gave away a bunch of their future first so 2027 and 2029 first round picks and that's where you could possibly see a Russell Westbrook thrown in there just for cap stuff and they're able to get off his contract as well but the Pacers in their rebuild would be able to get two unprotected first round picks and that would be a big win Lakers fans and NBA fans let me know what you would think about that that. For the Lakers, do you think it would be worth it? Because if you're looking at the Lakers in 2027 and 2029, what's the team going to be looking at? What's Anthony Davis going to be? Guys like Pat Bev, LeBron, like they're going to be up there in age. So it's not like that's your window. Your window to win is now and only now it seems like. So if you're able to get a Buddy Heald and get a Miles Turner, then maybe you could say, yeah, maybe we won't be as well positioned in the future. But you could give it one more shot at winning the title with LeBron because if you are you have LeBron you have to be going all in to win a finals that's all LeBron wants right now they want it right when they had him and now they're looking for another one so if you have a starting lineup you get LeBron Anthony Davis Miles Turner Buddy Heald they have some other role players as well because they made a bunch of signings for depth this offseason but a Miles Turner Buddy Heald move would be one that could really move the needle let me know what you guys think do you think it would be a worthy exchange for the Lakers I think if you're the Pacers and you're getting offered the two unprotected first, you probably make that move or are very interested. Let me know your thoughts on this Pacers-Lakers trade rumor.